Heroku is a platform as a service that lets developers build and operate cloud-based applications. In this video, we'll provide a brief demo of Heroku to help you decide if the platform is right for you. But if you're in a rush, we can help. Use our product selection tool at technologyadvice.com to get a free list of app development software recommendations. Click the link in the description below to get started. Heroku is a platform as a service, or PaaS, that developers use to make applications. Being a PaaS tool means developers can focus on coding without worrying about managing the infrastructure of their applications. Heroku is built on a managed container system and runs apps in smart containers. Supported languages include Node.js, Ruby, Java, PHP, Python, Go, Scala, and Clojure, or you can use another language through a third-party build pack as long as it runs on Linux. Heroku works for businesses of all sizes, and pricing depends on the type of app you want to build, the type of containers you need, and any additional products you may want, like Heroku Data Services or Heroku Postgres. You can try it out through a free trial, and Heroku also offers a free plan. Apps built on Heroku run in smart containers called Dynos. Dynos work in a fully managed runtime environment in which developers can deploy their application's code in any of the languages Heroku supports. Heroku takes care of monitoring and patching the system and language stacks to keep the platform up to date, reliable, and secure. Once your app is live, users can make requests through the Heroku platform, which are served by your application. There are three different ways you can deploy your application on Heroku, through Git, GitHub, and the Heroku button. Deploying code through Git starts by creating a local Git repository. From there, you can make a new app on Heroku from the Git repository and start writing code. Running a command to create a new Heroku app from Git creates a new Git remote, which you can use to push code and deploy your app. You can also use GitHub to deploy code to Heroku. Start by linking your GitHub account to Heroku and choosing the repository you want to link to your app. Once you've connected a repository, you can either manually deploy a particular GitHub branch or enable automatic deploys from GitHub. If you enable automatic deployment, every new push to a specific branch will deploy a new version of the app. Finally, you can deploy your app using the Heroku button in GitHub. To enable the Heroku button, you'll first need to embed an app.json file and then create a link in the README. Once you've done that, click the Heroku button on the repository you want to use for your app and Heroku will fetch your code to build and deploy a new application. You can expedite app development by using the Heroku Elements Marketplace to add elements like add-ons, buttons, and build packs. These can extend the functionality of Heroku, save you time in building out elements yourself, and improve your workflow. Heroku creates many of these elements itself, but individual developers and open source communities can also contribute to the Heroku Elements Marketplace. Still not sure if Heroku is right for you? Use our product selection tool at technologyadvice.com to get a free list of app development software recommendations. Click the button on the left to get started.